Hey guys, this is the part two of how to make your own intro on YouTube. And okay, I'm on Edge now, but I still suggest Chrome. So if you could use Chrome, still do that. But I'm gonna use I'm gonna use you know Edge right now. But anyways, you look up YouTube, and then oh, you're in like the middle section. Well, anyways. You will go to upload. And then you, you will click on files. Oh no, you don't have a file. Well, here's what you do. You would try to look through your folder that I already put it on here because it's much easier. But I mean, if you really want to, you might as well just go to the quick access and just input it from right here. Because that's just that's just much easier to do it that way and you just wait for it to load okay just wait for it to just wait for it to start public processing and then you publish it at the end see there's my intro you just publish it at the end and let's say you just want to change it and you do intro for how to make Okay, so let's say you did So you would probably click publish obviously I'm just going to make it as my first start off with Call of Duty Black Ops 3. But yes, it'll be publishing and it'll be loading and doing all that stuff. But for me, it says it would already be a duplicate. So I can't upload it again. But after it's done uploading, you just do that. And oh, I just want to add it to my videos. So if you guys want to add it to your videos, you go back here. And you look up this thing called Keep Vid. And you you just try to look for the one that that I would usually use. It would usually be that one. And you put in the video URL and then you and then you would uh, click download. Okay, let's say you did, but, well, it's not a video, so, well, anyways. Well, anyways. You would click download, and then after you click download, it would say download HD. As for me, I'm just going to do a quick tutorial so I can show you guys for YouTube. Let's say if I wanted to redo this one, redo this one. I didn't make this, but you would highlight it and you you would highlight it and you you Control C, but depending on what computer you have, it might be Command C, and then you and then you do this. Sometimes they like giving you a yes. Okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. What did you do? No, 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 Josh. But for me. It would be, but for some people, it'd be command, command V. But anyways, you click download. They like, like I said, they like showing you ads, so just ignore it. And you click download HD video. Keep clicking it until you don't get in, you know, like an, like something pop up. And once it finally pops up. You just click, you just click save, and wait for it to, to get all the way up, and 
you just pretty much just do that. And then you would use this uh, video, video editing software called Bandicut. You would actually need to download this one onto your computer, but it's no biggie. It's, it's a free download if you want to get the full version. It's like 30 bucks. But then you but then you actually get to like do the good stuff. And that's why my all my videos are like at 1033 seconds with Bandicam. But anyways, you download this and after you download that you click close all and you go on the Bandicut. Wait until Bandicut opens. Click, click join. And you, you don't need to just do it for this, but you would click ultimate do oh, no. You would click video free. And obviously, this is my intro. And then you would add another one, and then you, let's say we want to do this one. It's literally the same video. And then, as what I would do, I would just add my outro. You do the outro the same thing. I'll show you guys how to make your outro in the next video. But you do the same exact thing. And you do like this. And then you click start. Oh, high speed mode is, is not available. Well, that's nothing new. But anyways, you, you click. I would try to top this video for YouTube vid. And you just wait for it to do all this stuff. After it's done doing all that stuff, it would show up as like progress and all that stuff. Okay, so anyway, you just wait for it to load. This might go over the time limit, time limit depending on it, but if it does, here's what you gotta do. You click upload, and you should also click the check, you should also click the box that says open the output folder just in case. You click upload, and then it gives you the title and the description, and you can write whatever you want, and then you click upload, and then it would upload it, and then, and then it would just have a bar that says uploading, 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 and stuff like that. And then after it's done uploading, you're pretty much done, and you got your YouTube video. But if it does finish before, I'm still going to show you guys how to do it. So you just got, got to wait for it to load. Like I said, after it's done uploading, click upload, and pretty much that's what you got. So you wait. You would wait until it's done. It's probably gonna go past over the time limit. But time limit. But what I said, click on the box. It says open the output folder and put a check and then upload it. And it's gonna ask for the title and the description. You just write whatever you want to write on there. And then you click upload. And then there's gonna be a bar that says uploading. And then pretty much after it's done uploading, when that bar disappears. And the output folder opens up to show you that it's done. You're pretty much done, and it uploads to your YouTube channel. So that's pretty much what you gotta do. And yeah, I've got about another thirty.